Hello, James Marchington here with the latest news from TSC. So what's in the news this week? Well, we've got the winners of July's Olivia Tullet Gamebird Challenge. The Browning August Challenge is underway at the Oxford Gun Company. And elsewhere, Chris Packham makes another blunder, spreading a fake news story about puffins. All that, my pick of YouTube and more coming up after this. So let's start with the puffins. Chris Packer moves on a crusade to attack shooting by any means possible has put his foot in it again. He's been spreading a fake story about British shooters going abroad to shoot huge bags of puffins. You couldn't make it up, he tweeted, except somebody had. It came from a story written in the Telegraph by Helena Horton, who clearly has other interests besides the environment and specialises in clickbait stories on anything from sexism to chip fat. It looks like she was well and truly suckered by the pressure group The Campaign to Ban Trophy Hunting. Packham tweeted the nonsense and his followers lapped it up. Shooters smelt a rat, though, and it didn't take long before the story had been well and truly debunked. Shooting Times spoke to the Icelandic authorities and quickly proved it was totally fake. Some Icelandic hunters chipped in, commenting on the Telegraph story and explaining what really happens there. It even made the Guido Fawkes website. At least the Mirror had the decency to delete their fake news story. But the original Telegraph story is still there. And so is Packham's tweet, along with his classic blunder about lapwings. Frankly, it's a wonder anyone listens to a word he says. On to happier news. And last week saw the end of the Olivia Tullet Game Bird Challenge at the Oxford Gun Company. There are loads of winners with prizes in small ball, side by side, and ladies, as well as over and under. Top score was an impressive 94 by Chris Childerhouse, who wins an Olivia Tullet fleece lined waistcoat, which should keep him nice and warm when he's shooting this winter. Second was Phil Bunyan on 92, closely followed by Charlie Stewart Wood with 91. They also win Olivia Tullet goodies. For the full list of prize winners, see the Oxford Gun Company's Facebook page. With that one behind us, August is Browning Month at the Oxford Gun Company, with two Browning 525 shotguns to be won on the 100th sporting competition. The Browning August Challenge is open until the 31st of this month. On top of the two B525s, there are prizes in Open, Juniors and Ladies categories. You can shoot that one with any gun. It doesn't need to be a Browning. There's also the hugely popular Browning Rabbit Mania running throughout the month. That one you do have to shoot with a Browning, but there are lone guns available if you want. For details, see the website oxfordguncompany.co.uk or call to book your slot on 01844 238 308. With the school holidays in full swing, the ground is running a series of junior activity days where anyone from the age of 10 upwards can come and have some fun with archery, air rifles and slingshots, all under expert instruction, of course. They're on every Wednesday throughout August and you can book a morning or an afternoon session. For details, call the shop on 01844 238 308. Now for my pick of the latest shooting videos on YouTube. I've chosen two very different videos for you this week. First up, it's Ben Husthwaite's latest instruction video on Field Sports Channel. In this one, he's showing his technique for shooting a going away chandelle and using a shot cam to demonstrate how it's done. Then for a bit of pigeon action, there's this one from JM Shoot TV. He's having a terrific day, shooting over decoys on a laid patch of wheat. There's links to both of those in the description below. Now, don't forget it's just a month to go before the Oxford Festival of Shooting on the 7th of September. It's going to be a great day out for all the family, with trade stands, have a go on clays, air guns, archery and axe throwing, plus gun dogs, country clothing, refreshments and loads more. That day also sees the return of the TSC series, with the next qualifier in the series that leads up to the grand final, when one girl and one boy will each win an MG car. 
the TSC Winter Series is open to anyone under 21 and in full-time education. And regardless of experience, it's a great launchpad into competitive shooting. The dates of all those shoots are up on the website, so make sure you've got them in your diary. For the competitions on the 7th of September and the 2nd of October, you'll need to book a place. All the rest you can enter on the day. You can find all the details at theschoolschallenge.co.uk. Well, that's it for this week's news. Thanks for watching. Please help us out by giving this video a thumbs up and tell your shooting friends about this channel too. And make sure you've subscribed and click the little notification bell to keep up to date with all our latest videos. As always, we've got another one coming out this Thursday at 7.30 p.m. So make sure to catch that one. And remember, it's important to support our sponsors when you're shopping for a new gun, cartridges, clothing and so on. This channel simply couldn't exist without them. See you Thursday.